Hey guys, it's Tuesday and this is the ornament of the week. So today we're going to take this onion shaped ornament um, that I have previously Mod Podged with red tissue paper and we are going to Mod Podge it some more. I have cut out uh, pieces from uh, a paper doily that you use like, to put cakes on and stuff. So I have pieces that look like this, this, and like curvy sections. So we're going to take those pieces of the doily and Mod Podge them onto the ornament um, all around in some sort of design that I haven't really thought what it's going to be yet. So here goes. So I took the curvy parts and some scotch tape uh, to attach them to the ornament to keep them in place because you know you can't just like stick them on there um, to form a garland kind of shape and now I'm gonna mod podge it on there so now we have uh, an ornament that has some um, squiggles that are uh, been mod podged and are very wet and like don't want to stay down yeah, my recommendation is <coughs> to Mod Podge the back of your pieces uh, because they are raised and textured. So Mod Podge this, Mod Podge the spot where you're going to put it, stick it, Mod Podge on top heavily. Um, and hopefully it will stay. I think I am going to put um, these little doodads here maybe? I'm, I'm not sure. I think that seems like a good thing. And uh, maybe these like bigger ones right here. Stay tuned for the next part! So we had a slight change of plans. Um, instead of using these little guys, I cut out some of the points uh, from the doily and glued the little sections uh, around the top so when it dries uh, you'll be able to see kind of will kind of make sort of a star five pointed star sort of as you can see the first part has dried somewhat um, so the silver is showing through again um, and it looks pretty nice I think that's what it looks like from the bottom it's pretty even not exactly even but you know who's going to notice no one that's who Alright guys, she's dried a little bit. Um, I added some little dots here on the bottom and the top is dried a bit uh, to the touch and I think that she is done. Look at that. Isn't it amazing what you can do with Mod Podge and some random scraps of paper? Or doily. So we're going to do a non-Mod Podge ornament next week, just so you're prepared. I think I may have to do some bonus videos to get all these ornaments in before Christmas. I hope you all have enjoyed uh, the craft tutorials. Um, I really like doing them. Uh, it gives me something to do during the week, and it's something that I enjoy. So I may try to do different craft things once Christmas is over, because that's kind of what I do. Um... I will see you guys next week. I hope everyone's doing well. Um, I personally can't wait for this week to be over. It's one of those weeks. It's only Tuesday. And I can't wait for it to be over. I will see you guys next week with another ornament tutorial. Bye! I need not centered in the frame. <laughs> Whoa! I'm spinning. <laughs> Why is this happening to me? I didn't. I don't know. All right, here we go. Hey guys, it's Tuesday, and this is the ornament we're gonna make us spinning. Leon, why does your chair spin? Uncontrollably. That's unacceptable. <laughs> Oh, that's unacceptable. <laughs> oh, God, this is hilarious.